Lucy would hope to finish in the top two here and then go and chase the time. But if she didn't and were third here, then again, she'd have to hope that the selectors would look kindly on not just a performance here, but what she manages to do in the next couple of weeks, perhaps at the European Championships. Women's 100 meter hurdle final. <laughs> Tiffany Porter gets away well, very well. Alongside her, uh, Drew just going behind with Tiffany Porter, Sydney Feely trying to get back on terms with all the sister Lucy Hatton following the two of them. But it's Tiffany Porter, here comes Sydney. Will she get there on the line? No! Big Sis wins. And the two of them will join each other in the British Olympic team. 12 92 with a two meter following win. And no doubt there that the two of them have finished first and second. Cindy Feely didn't get such a good start. And uh, Tip Porter must have been aware that she was chasing her down, was very close at the end. And that, well, certainly on the nod, I've given it to Tiffany Porter. They're both looking, we're waiting for the photo finish to come up. There is a bit of, I'm sure, sisterly rivalry here in terms of who is the UK champion. But to me, well, it just needs to go half a bit. Yeah, well, that looks as though it's Tip Porter still. Yeah, I mean, close to the finish, but one at the start, really. There we are, uh, confirmation. Oh, but it has been confirmed now, Tiffany Porter taking it just on the far side from her, her younger sister, but it was one at the start because Cindy Ophelia was far slower to the first barrier and she was actually hurdling and moving quicker between the barriers as well. She was gaining all the time. If that was a, if that was a 110 hurdle, she would have won. Uh, and that perhaps is a very encouraging for Cindy Ophelia as well. Tiffany Porter takes the title, but Cindy Ophelia was looking quicker. And you see, um, well, Steve's pointing out the reaction times as well. And you look at the reaction time. I mean, we're looking at lane six. Cindy Philly sitting in her blocks there. 0 0.2 her reaction time. So much work to do. But watch her move through here. First of all, past Lucy Hatton. She's got that speed and she's gaining. She's bearing down on her older sister all the time. And again, she just looks to have perhaps a little bit more raw speed there than, than Tiffany Porter. Again, from the other side, Tiffany Porter out so well along with Lucy Hatton and just tucked in behind Lucy Hatton at the moment is Cindy Ophelia but watch her come through the two vests of Woodford Green but Tiffany Porter just holding on my little sister is not going to beat me well she very nearly did and she looks very good for the the rest of the season as well but I think most importantly for these two that they're safely through because things can happen in hurdles of course they can there you go then sister